for each diagram, write down an equation and then solve it to find x. So in the first case, we've got a triangle and we know that the angle sum on in a triangle is 180 degrees. So we use that to form an equation. So we're going to start with x plus 20 plus 2x plus 2x plus 10 is equal to 180. So we now formed our equation. We now need to solve it. First step will be to collect like terms. So we have x plus 2x plus 2x. And then we have 20 plus 10. So just grouping the like terms together is equal to 180. x plus 2x plus 2x makes 5x. 20 plus 10 makes 30. And that's equal to 180 degrees. This is now an equation that we are familiar with on how to solve. So opposite of adding 30 is to take 30 from both sides. So that will leave 5x on this side and then 180 minus 30 gives 150. Now we have to divide both sides by 5. That will give x on this side and then 150 divided by 5 gives me 30 degrees. And using that information I could go back and find all the angles if I wanted to. In the second situation, we got what's known as a Z angle or alternate angles, and then alternate angles are equal. So it's straight away I can say that 3x plus 20 will be equal to 80 degrees, and then solve this equation. So first of all, the opposite of adding 20 is to take 20 from both sides. So take 20 from this side, we get 3x. Take 20 from this side, we get 60. And then divide both sides by 3. So if we divide by 3 on this side, we get x. And if we do 60 divided by 3, we get 20 on this side. And then going back, we could actually find the value of that angle. We should know it's actually 80. And we can see that 3 times 20 is 60 plus 20. That makes 80. They need to be equal. Okay, so there's been a video to show you how to form and solve equations from a given diagram. I hope you've understood, and I thank you very much for watching.